guys! I made cute decorative vases that you can use for flowers alone or you can light them up at night with the flowers or on its own as a glass lamp. It is such an interesting DIY and I'd like to share with you guys how I made it. Now let's go ahead and get started. What I did was to take a poster board that I cut out to size and I spray painted it silver and then I measured 0.5 inches and made lines out of them and cut them with a pair of scissors. Here I'm just taking the strips and at the both ends I'm folding them at about say an inch spacing and I'm going to be doing that for all the strips. This is the vase that I'll be using that I got from the Dollar Tree and now I'm going to start gluing on the strips to the vase. I will be leaving a full list of all the items that I'll be using for this project in the description box below. Before I came to the conclusion to actually use poster boards, I tried a lot of materials that would be suitable but for some reason because you're gluing it on glass, it doesn't really hold as much. Even if you clean down the glass, it doesn't still hold. So I'm going to be using a hot glue gun just to keep the pieces in place first and then I'm going to go around again with Mod Podge. This is what it should look like and now I'm going to be taking these gems and gluing them onto the strips using Mod Podge. I took a small brush and then I'm going to be using the Mod Podge just to brush it down but not all the way down just at short intervals just so it doesn't dry out and then you put on your gems. I will not be putting all the gems from top to bottom on all of the strips. I mean, it's just my design, but if you like, you can make yours that way. Before we go any further, this is what happens if you use just glue. And even with an E6000 glue, it still does the same thing. And so I'm going to be using Mod Podge to seal it off. And it's only Mod Podge that worked so far. I don't know why, but just Mod Podge worked alone. So I'm going to be using a generous amount at the top and at the bottom. When I was done with sealing it off with the Mod Podge, I completed putting on all my gems and this is what it looks like. I did the same thing using a shorter vase. And this is what they look like side by side. I wanted to make a really long one, so I took two vases and then I glued them all together. And then I used golden color this time around and this is what it looks like. For the silver vases, you can put in your flowers in there and enjoy the view. This is the smaller vase and it's so cute. I then took both vases and placed them together and it's so beautiful. I took string lights and put it in both vases and yes, I love it. This is the taller vase that I use golden strips in making and I really love how this one gives off its own elegance. And when you place them together, they look so cute! Gold and silver. And then you can put lightings at the top and at the bottom. Let me know in the comment section below which of the three bases you prefer. And remember to like and share. And also remember to turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on my latest videos. Thank you so much for watching and I have other videos linked in the description box below. Do check them out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button. 